This past week, New York Senator Chuck Schumer came here to the North Country to tout new lower prescription drug prices that will soon be available to seniors. During a visit to Condo Pharmacy in Plattsburgh, Schumer showed off a list of the 10 popular medications commonly used by seniors that beginning in 2026 will cost much less for the 46,000 seniors enrolled in Medicare here in the North Country. These are great drugs. They're life-saving. The companies do a great job coming up with them. But they have become so expensive that we have had instance after instance where people take a dose every other day, cut a pill in half, decide whether to buy food or take the drug, pay the rent, take the drug. So I've been working very hard to try and get these prices lower. And just three weeks ago, the federal government announced for the first time in history lower, fairer prices for 10 common prescription drugs for our seniors. For folks here in the North Country, that's a real shot in the arm. Schumer says the new prices are the result of the Inflation Reduction Act signed by President Biden two years ago, giving Medicare the ability to negotiate directly with drug companies. He also highlighted a $35 cap on insulin for seniors enrolled in Medicare. Schumer says the new pricing plan will also include a $2,000 cap on total out-of-pocket prescription drug costs for seniors, beginning this coming January. Joining him at Condos Pharmacy were three seniors who all say they will benefit from the lower prices on the 10 prescriptions. Linda Gass from Al Sable says she's pleased she'll be able to save money. I am so appreciative that you are working on this. I could never figure out how much money I should be saving up for or putting aside for because they're different every single time I go in the pharmacy and ask. And the nice lady behind the counter always says, do you know how much this costs, dear? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and Schumer says Congress plans to keep adding additional prescriptions to the list every year.